our freak uh, got out of the car. This is a lot of fun. So, um, yeah, it's beautiful out here. It's quiet. So, let's take a walk. Start going uh, on the edge of lot one. The Oahis are amazing from here. Marsing is a really great community. It's small and agricultural and very welcoming. Um, we're in the wine region of Idaho as well. There's lots of really nice vineyards and wine tasting rooms. Um, so I'd say the, the benefit of this lot one is that it'd be at the end of this particular development. All four of these lots are spread out enough that I don't think it's going to be a huge issue. Oh, look at the river. We have to find out exactly where the lot lines are. But, uh, so, one of the things I want to point out is you've got the access to the river right, right here. Um, the way you were wanting to build out your daylight basement, these lots uh, lend themselves, I think, to do that. Uh, again, you've got that. That's a big island right there. Right in the middle is an island. So obviously no one's going to be building on top of that. Across there you have other, you know, little ranchettes. I don't know. They seem established and divided enough that I don't see them being developed much further past that. Well, and the river property won't be developed overly. Well, I mean, they could probably split off a, a parcel or two, but I don't see, you know, certainly no apartments or anything like that. Or overcrowding. Yeah, so, um, but just to look at, let's, you want to talk about, take a walk? Yeah. This way. Marsing has one of my favorite restaurants, um, Guy Fieri did a review on it. It's called The Orchard House. Definitely a must place to eat. Lots of locals go there. So again, we'll take a look and see where that property line is, but just to give you an idea what's on the other side of this, this nut. But boy, I tell you, these views here are just beautiful. buy this so that I can come down here and duck hunt in front of your property. <laughs> Sturgeon fish, I guess we can do that too. I think I should come for some more bears there too. So, I don't know. So they've got the, there's the sign. Yeah. There's the back of that side. I guess is these white markers. Are those? Yeah. Yeah. I would think so. They have some neat little hikes out here. I often take my kids out to Jump Creek. It's not very far from here. There's like you hike in this mild little hike into the waterfalls, which is pretty neat. He's wanting to build right on the edge here. But 
that daylight? Daylight basement or how that would work. Yeah, geographically that might lend well to that. I'm thinking lot two is from that white post and that white post to that white post and that white post. And then the river view all along. Sorry if this is shaky. must go back there. That must include that, that little knoll. Yeah. See where that little line is. I wonder. Yeah, the other whites. Yeah, the stakes. This is a nice building lot right here. This so. is two. Yes. Or, no, yeah. this one's two. Yeah. We're on three. Yeah, look at that corner post is four. This one's three. This one's two. That one's one. No. See, the first signs were that. Oh, all right. Yeah, but that one's three right there. Don't listen to me, I'm wrong. Yeah. See, you heard it. Imagine right? that. slope down. Take him down there. I'll take you down just to see what's down this way. And my guess is I don't think I think this is more like high water mark maybe. I don't know how far down this goes. And yeah, but it's, it dips down there a bit. It's kind of steep right there. there yeah. yeah, you do want a clear path because these prickly bushes, well, they hurt. So, but. You uh, like wildlife? There's lots of wildlife that come through here. Oh yeah. Yeah, you've got deer sitting here. And eagles also So if you're wanting to, walk out there to the water. Maybe one is better. All right, flip you back around. So, say cheese. No, I don't like videos. Even more reason to video Stop you. it. <laughs> Anywho, my friend, uh, yeah, nice stretch if you wanted to stretch the budget, right? If you want any more information on this area, um, I have lots of, it's one of my favorite places in Oh yeah, we love it here. I've been living out there for over 20 years. Alright, signing out.